President Tsai Ing-wen marks one year in office tomorrow, and today she took the opportunity to address her low approval ratings for the first time, linking them to the challenging reforms she's tackling. At a meeting with foreign journalists, Tsai added that she was working to secure progress and wasn't afraid to step on some toes in the course of pursuing her policy priorities. On the eve of her first full year in the presidential office, Tsai met with a group of representatives from overseas Chinese language media outlets and attempted to explain the reasons for her low approval ratings. I chose to push the most difficult reforms during the first year of my first term in office. No past president did that. From the perspective of approval ratings, that might not have been the best choice. We expected fluctuating ratings. It's the price we have to pay. But as long as these reforms benefit the country, we are not afraid of offending anyone. The president also took the chance to speak to her supporters over criticism that the speed of reform has been too slow. We are a democratic country. There's no way Taiwan is going back to the totalitarian era. If we can't endure disagreement, how can we embrace democracy? Despite her sliding approval ratings, Tsai stressed she's still determined to press on with her reform drives. During the coming year, we will enter the next phase, a new phase. The most important goal of the cabinet is execution. Although the presidential office earlier canceled a previous plan for the president to speak to the media today, the president still managed to take time to reflect on her first year in office.